एम आई इंडिया रिसेंटली लॉन्च एम आई फोर आई इन इंडिया एंड दे कॉल्ड इट एज अ फ्लैगशिप फॉर इंडिया एंड इन माई टेस्टिंग आई फाउंड आउट दैट दिस डिवाइस हीट्स अप लाइक क्रेजी वेल प्लेइंग गेम्स बट द रिसेंट अपडेट से इज दैट इट विल फिक्स द परफॉर्मेंस एज वेल एज हीटिंग इशूज सो विल इट लेट्स फाइंड आउट दिस इज सौरभ नहार यूर फ्रॉम ऑल वर टेक्नोलॉजीज लेट्स बिगिन Now before moving ahead let me tell you one thing that you guys might have MI UI 6.4.2 running on your phone but I have the MI UI 6.5.4 running on my phone which is the pre OTA update you might get this OTA update in future but in case you don't want to wait you can download it and run on your phone for that you can visit aatechnology.in for the step by step guide how to do it So here is the MI 4i in my hand I recently rebooted it after keeping it aside for 10 to 15 minutes and now let's run antutu benchmark to see what the results are after updating this device to the new version and as you can see that the score is 38616 which is very decent you can see all the details in case you want to know that all the details are over here Now let's check out the gaming experience on the MI 4i after updating this device the time is 11 pm and the battery is at 15% if you can see that Now let's play some games and see how it works you can see the temperature is at 35 degrees which is normal enough and i kept this device aside for around 10 to 15 minutes i switched off my device and kept it aside to cool down so that we can get the best results and i'm playing asphalt 8 on the high graphics and i can feel some improvements in gaming although i have noticed few lags in between while playing this game but that is very negligible overall the gameplay is very smooth The main reason why I'm doing this gaming test is to check out the temperature after 15 to 20 minutes because they claim to fix the heating issue. Let's see how much the heating issue or the heating is reduced on MI 4i after the update. Do note that this is a pre OTA update and you guys will receive it soon. I'm playing GTA San Andreas on max settings which is high graphics again. Now the game is working just fine, no major lags. Although it is not the smoothest experience, but we can play GTA San Andreas, which is a high-end game. And I can feel some warmness at the top side of the device, near the camera portion, and even on the front side of the device on the display. We will check the temperature after 15 minutes to see if. There are any improvements or not on this device after the update? The gaming experience is slightly improved, I would say. And also do note that I am playing all the games in performance mode. I have changed the battery settings to performance. and it is not on the balance mode now let's play modern combat 5 which is a high end game and as of now i am unable to notice any major lag Also you can notice some minor lags here and there but uh, that is very decent but overall you can play the game which is modern combat 5 a very high end game and the device is getting a bit more warm at the back side of the device we will check the temperature after this game 
and the time will reach to around 15 minutes. So as you guys have already seen that I was playing all the high end games on the MI4i for about 13 to 14 minutes. And now let's see what the time is. So you can see the time is 11.15. I have played games for about 15 minutes and the battery has reached to 5% from 15%. Now let's see what the temperature is on the front side of the device. You can see it is 45 to 47 degrees on the front side as you could see it is also exceeding 50 percent on the top side of the device near the earpiece so that is really hot it is above 45 degrees which is not normal because 45 degrees or below that is normal you can see at the back side near the camera portion it is ranging between 45 to 47 degrees so this was the quick test of the new update on the MI4i. Hope you guys liked it and if you did make sure you hit that like button down below. Also post your comments and queries in the comment section. I try to answer most of them. You can follow me on Facebook, Twitter and Google Plus and the links for the same will be in the description down below. Make sure you share with your friends this video because it will help them a lot. Also subscribe to my channel for more such videos and I'll be coming up with a lot of videos on other devices. So stay tuned for that. Hit that subscribe button right now. This is Saurabh Nahar here from All About Technologies. Thank you guys for watching.